टुडे वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट होमोलोगस क्रोमोजोम्स सो वी विल अंडरस्टैंड वॉट होमोलोगस क्रोमोजोम मीन्स सो बिफोर अंडरस्टैंडिंग द होमोलोगस क्रोमोजोम लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड वॉट क्रोमोजोम इज मेड अप ऑफ क्रोमोजोम इज मेड अप ऑफ डी एन ए थ्रेड डी एन ए थ्रेड कॉल्स अप एंड देन सुपर कॉल्स अप टू फॉर्म द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द क्रोमोजोम सो क्रोमोजोम इज अ सुपर कॉयल स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द डी एन ए एंड डी एन ए इज द जेनेटिक मेटीरियल वी कैन ड्रॉ अ क्रोमोजोम इन द डायग्राम एज दिस दिस इज द इक्वल स्ट्रक्चर फॉर द क्रोमोजोम इन द क्रोमोजोम देर आर जीन्स प्रेजेंट सो वॉट इज अ जीन अ जीन इज अ स्पेसिफिक लेंथ ऑफ डी एन ए which can code a specific protein or or a specific rna and the location of the gene in a chromosome is very specific and that location of that gene in the chromosome is called the locus of the gene two chromosomes with the same gene locus are called the homologous chromosomes homologous because the locus of the gene is same in the both the chromosomes among these two homologous chromosomes one comes from the father and the other comes from the mother so let's take a species which is a diploid species uh, having total six chromosomes so in the sperm we will get three chromosomes and the same set of other three chromosomes will be in the ovum so when the sperm and the ovum fuses and forms the zygote we get three chromosomes from the sperm these three chromosomes we can number them as chromosome number 1 2 and 3 and the same and equivalent chromosomes will be found in the ovum also and we can also name them as chromosome number 1 2 and 3 and the chromosome number 1 from father will be similar or equivalent to the chromosome number 1 one from the ovum or from the mother so these two chromosomes the chromosome number 1 from father and chromosome number 1 from mother will have same genes in the same locus and they will also look pretty similar to each other so this is chromosome number 1 from the father which has a gene in this lo- location or this is the gene locus and let's assume the gene is for eye color then the chromosome number 1 from mother will also look similar and will also have the gene for eye color in the same location that's why they are homologous chromosomes and these two can pair up and these two are called the homologous chromosomes because they have the same gene in the same locus and they are quite similar to each other in structure as they have the same genes in the same locus so they are called homologous chromosomes so the chromosome number 2 will also pair with the chromosome number 2 from the mother side so these two one from father and one from mother and the chromosome number 3 from the father side will pair with the chromosome number 3 of the mother side so these two are the homologous pairs or homologous chromosomes so inside the zygote we will get total six number of chromosomes and three pairs of homologous chromosomes in each pair one is from the father side and the other is from the mother side and having the same genes in case of human we have 23 pairs of chromosomes or 23 pairs of homologous chromosomes or total 46 chromosomes and this chromosome number 1 we can see one is from father side and the other is from mother side and this is a homologous pair of chromosomes which is forming the f- chromosome number 1 homologous pair in case of 
sex chromosome number 2 one is also from father and other is from mother and these all of the pairs are homologous pairs that's why in case of the chromosome numbers we use the term 23 pairs of chromosomes that means 23 homologous pairs of chromosomes we get 23 chromosomes from father and 23 chromosomes from mother total 46 chromosomes in human